Hello everyone, it's me JB from Unix Tutorials. Today, in this video, I'll show you how to get iPhone-like image cutout feature in any Samsung smartphones running One UI. So, would I for more delay? Let's begin. So, right now you can see my Samsung home screen. So, firstly, what you need to do is just go to the phone settings and just click on this software update and click on this download and install and check for if any newer software updates is available or not for your respective Samsung smartphone. So right now in my case, my software is up to date. So firstly, kindly check for any software updates. And after that, just open the Samsung Gallery application. Now just tap on this three horizontal lines at the right bottom and just click on the settings. Scroll down below and just tap on this about Gallery and check for any updates available for your Samsung Gallery application or not. So right now you can see the Gallery application is also up to date in my case. So firstly, do these two things. And now, just select any photo or images available inside your Samsung Gallery application. So I'll just open this. Now you can see here one image, right? So I want to cut out the only the image that is the only this person's picture I don't want the background so what I will do is just tap and hold so you can see here it's being cut out so let us do it again just tap and hold again now you can drag it so you can see here you're completely cut out right so you can see here and now if you want to save it without a uh, background then just click on save as image now it will be saved on your gallery application just move back you can see here the image which we have cut out without a background so by using this method you can easily get iphone like image cutout feature in any Samsung smartphones running One UI very easily. So if you never known about these cool tricks then you should definitely give it a try. So if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching.